All right, my lovers. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Whenever you see this, I'm MJ. I'm the founder of Ultra Love, and I'm happy to be here doing a little daily reading with you. I do the daily readings here on Instagram and TikTok and on YouTube, and we also do monthly readings and sometimes weekly readings. There's a Patreon community. There's merchandise, online courses. There's a book and uh, a lot of love. Anyway, we're going to get into this little daily reading straight up, you guys. You know what I'm like? I recorded a reading earlier today and I didn't spit and it wasn't a burp. <laughs> but I just got to a point where I'm like, I can't, I can't publish this video. I can't because I was laughing and thinking, oh God, did they hear that? I don't know. Good morning, everybody. So it's December 28th. I've had a little bit of a time, a, a little bit of time off and it's appreciated and welcomed and nice time with family and friends over the holidays. And I hope that you all um, have had a warm, safe season. So much peace and prayers goes out to the entire world that is suffering right now. It's a holla shazam. I wish deeply, deeply that the world could be a more loving place for all of us. Hence, all to love, like all, all, not a few of us over here or those people over there with that thing. You know, all of us, all of us, genuine, have have a right and deservingness. I digress. Okay, divine guidance and loving clarity is my intention with the readings. Divine guidance and loving clarity. There's a decision here on this December twenty eighth day. I feel like this is the decision about which party do I go to. That's what I'm feeling. So honestly, it's like you've got a lot of options. You got a few invitations. I, I'm not going to lie. I feel a bit lackluster in this. It feels a bit like, do I even want to go to any of them? I don't know. It's up to you, my lovers. <laughs> Ooh, look. Be beautiful. I'm looking down and I can see the star card. Ten of cups. What, what? And the world. All in the upright. Ha, <laughs> ha. Five of, five of wands. Five of wands. That's okay. Overcoming conflict to get to a point of mental clarity where you can make a decision. You might just choose to stay at home. That's allowed, okay? You're allowed to just stay at home and rest as well. The decision is likely going to help with this, like, conflict. Yeah, I do. I'm like, I, I feel like some of you are just conked, pooped, tired. You're, it's like, even just lovely messages, you're like, Ugh. right? And so that that would tell me, I'm like, ooh, you might need a little bit of alone time to make a decision from a place of integrity and compassion, including the self-compassion. Yeah, because you're not, it's like you're not going to get, if you're just like, I don't want to make a decision. <laughs> yeah. Sort of like the Eight of Swords, but... At two of swords, you're still blindfolded. Oh, God, I don't want to have to make a decision. Well, you're going to have to because if, if you're not going to make a decision, you're not going to get to calmer waters. So the this this making a decision, and again, I, I do feel in the lightheartedness of today's reading that this is just about, like, going to a party. But as long as you're like, yeah, sure, but you don't want to go, you might feel a bit on edge. You might feel a bit unrested. I, yeah, honestly, the card, just like, the cards are like, nothing in these cards are like, I want to go party. I want to go hang out with people. Um, if anything, you might want to have a bath. Um, you might want to Go swimming. The The water is coming through really strong. It's like, or, you know, go swimming, have a bath, go to the jacuzzi, go to the spa alone. And that's what's going to help you. Okay, there might be other people in the public pool or at the sea, whatever, but you taking that little bit of time to, to just swim and there's something about the water cleansing though as well to cleanse your field and body to then 
be like, okay, that's, sorry guys, I'm not going to go to the party, okay? Or, okay, I'm not doing that, but I'm going to do this. Or I won't see you, I won't see you at the after party, but I'll come to the dinner kind of thing. I, I'm just getting a sense that some of you just don't have that extra bit of energy to give to a certain situation or to give to a plethora of situations. You're like, you're feeling this real need to contain your energy, to bring your energy back home. Hence, like, just having a bath, having a wash, having a shower, having, going for a dip in the sea, if that's relevant to you, or going to the local pool, whatever works, right? Like water, the element, cleansing, water under the bridge, et cetera. Like uh, that's supporting your ability to make decisions. And it, the right decision for you, for some of you might not be doing that thing with those people. It might be actually just hanging out by yourself and saying no. I know, right? It's so weird. Like this one is like saying no is the most horrible thing. <laughs> it's like, well, just no or yes. It just depends on the situation, right? But yeah, that, but these, it's like if when we get a bit frenetic, when we're trying to do too much stuff and when we're too in our heads, we tend to start to feel really trapped and chaotic. Hence where I was saying that thing of like coming home and just coming back to yourself in your little container uh, which could be just you hanging out at home or you going for a drive or you getting in away for a night or you going to the pool to the sea just doing something for yourself alone where you can like clear your space clear your energy and have the correct guidance for you what's right for you today and that energy feels nice healing sometimes just like chilling out all day like being at home and just I don't know, drinking green juice or not, or like eating cake, whatever, is the most healing thing. You know, like I think we get all wrapped up in the rights and the wrongs rather than just getting to know thyself. Uh, it's so liberating and at the same time, like super dupes challenging, you know, because it's only in us. We're the ones that are having our own experience. Um, healing ourselves is the real success and liberation, isn't it? Hmm. yeah I think for some of you there's a little bit of a message here about coming back to your like sp spiritual practice whatever that means to you maybe have again quiet time to me sacred solitude can often be its own practice but then within that maybe you were wanting to meditate a bit more see there's something about just sitting in silence because some of us were in silence but their phones are going and we're aware that like oh so and so when we do this and well you know thought that that's hence meditation because thoughts are just like reeling around and then that doesn't help us heal necessarily it doesn't help us actually get the clarity that we're deeply desiring for a transformation and a successful sense of liberation so the meditation station vibration <laughs> is the success card for you and that deeper sense of silence and clarity is ultimately going to help you make that decision whether yes or no right you're it's all good we we're eternal right yeah okay the it's, the messages are clear look after yourselves take a day love your body <sighs> maybe have an alone day you know or again swimming water bathing there's something in that too maybe you'll have a good cry when you're in the bath or something <laughs> right hala hala i'm gonna leave it there my lovers it's been fun it's i've missed you yesterday i really felt i was like oh my god i've been away for days and i miss my lovers um but i hope you've had a great you know festive season and whatnot and uh, sometimes i find it all you know just there's so much crazy and i i uh, just continue to pray basically for our evolution and enlightenment as a species to not be uh in these horrible horrible power dynamics and you know really we all deserve to be here anyway i'm not going to harp on about it you guys feel me a mega love for all of you. Keep praying for peace. Um, power to the people. Peace out, you guys.